we don't get many of this type of cars anymore. This is the 66 registration SVR in the black, fully loaded, 50,000 miles, full service history in a beautiful condition. And what I meant by we don't get many of this, most of our SVRs are the newer versions, 21, 22 registration. But every so often we get a nice sort of four or five year old one that's been very well looked after, one owner from new, with a massive specification and it's priced absolutely bang on. Now this is gonna go live today, the next couple of hours, and it probably won't make it past the weekend because of the way it looks, because of the way it drives, because of the way it sounds. 550 brake horsepower in the Santorini black, which is a metallic black, full black styling on it, upgraded wheels. It's just a beautiful car. You compare this to all the other SVRs that are available. They've normally got six owners, service history is a bit shady at best, and they just look a little bit rough and tired. Now, don't get me wrong, the car's got 50,000 miles on. Will there be some element of wear? Absolutely, be buying a £110,000 car for almost half price. So starting from the front, you've got the full LED style daytime running lights, headlight washers, the beautiful SVR bumpers with the big air vents, front rear parking sensors, cruise control and adaptive cruise control. The black badging, the black grills, the bonnet grills are finished in black as well. And as you come round the side, you'll notice straight away you have the two-piece side vendor there, the arch kit, front and rear. But then this one has the upgraded 22-inch alloy wheels, which are in perfect condition. No corrosion, no curb damage, nothing. Like I said, go and find another one on this similar age, similar mileage, and you'll see loads of corrosion around here. You'll see curb marks everywhere where somebody's tried to touch it up, and you think, really? Am I buying a car of this quality with touched up wheels? It's just not what we do here. You've then got the beautiful Brembo red brake calipers there. The side vents, again, finished in black. Black window surrounds, the full tilt and sliding panoramic roof, and you have a sun protection glass. This car also has a fixed side steps, which again, are in beautiful condition. Come for access, and that's for the interior. The first thing you'll notice are them beautiful SVR seats. I think they're absolutely amazing. The way they're designed, the perforated seats there, the leather, the lovely silver beading, electric seats, memory seats, heated seats, for both driver and passenger. This car then also has, if you haven't noticed already, the full carbon fiber interior inlays. That's a center dash, middle dash, door cards, the control areas. Also, if you look at the media system, this is the more updated version because in the 1666, you could have got the smaller screen, the older version of the media, or this, the newer version. Dual zone climate control, you have got the interior fridge as well under the armrest, which is also leather wrapped, with USBs in there as well. Going back to the media system, you've got in control apps in there, which is lovely. Your ambient lighting, which is great with the different colors, which is a nice little touch. There's a carbon fiber, front and rear heated windscreen, air suspension with your sport exhaust. More carbon fiber, SVR badging, the full roof lining is finished in Alcantara, which is a lovely finish, and you have the double sun visor as well, one that goes that way, and one that goes to the side. Frameless interior mirror covers, and then there's little cubby holes. Again, look at the, the quality of all the carbon fiber, no blackness coming off, nothing like that. As for the rear passengers, they get the same treatment. The beautiful sports seat, the third zone climate control, the carbon fibre continues around the back. The Meridian sound system, rear heated seats, that lovely hardback rear seat on the driver and passenger. But again, look at the condition, because when you're buying a 50,000 mile car, you normally expect lots of indentations, scratches, scuffs, cigarette burns, none of that here at all whatsoever. Round the back, Again, this is a stunning car. The first thing this car has is a smoked rear lighting system, so they've been tinted to make the car a bit more aggressive. Quad tailpipes, black badging, automatic tailgate, which can be used off the key or press the button. Reversing camera system and a very, very generous boot. Seats go down 60-40 and underneath you have got a spare wheel, only a dinky one, but it is better than nothing. Press the button, it closes away again. The rear bumper's obviously a bit more aggressive. It's not your standard range of a sport, it's an SVR. So you can see with the air vents that come around the side, the floor with the rear valance there. No dents on all, all part of the car. There is no dents or scratches really. Like I said, you would expect a little bit of wear with stone chips, etc. As for the driver's cockpit area, you've got the leather wrapped steering wheel with the heated steering wheel. Paddle shift, there's adaptive cruise control, the full digital dash there, reversing camera works, Dead simple, put in reverse in high definition with the guidelines just there. Different drive terrains down here. More leather on the dashboard and top dash as well, but it sounds unbelievable. 
because the newer ones, which are absolutely fabulous, because I sell any amount here, and they are brilliant, but because they have that soft limiter thing on, they just don't sound like that. This is an absolute weapon. Isn't gonna hang around. My name and number's on the bottom of the screen. Give me a call, drop me a text or a WhatsApp, and they're more than happy to help you. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye now.